I've been playing Crusaders Lost Idols for a few days now and have amassed myself a nice collection of 11 chests. So I thought I'd open them all at the same time and we can see what goodies we've got in them. Now, they're not all the same chests. It's a collection. Some of them are the chests you get from defeating bosses where I expect to get free items. There are some that I've paid for. So these are the ones you buy here for money. It may have five cards as opposed to three in the bosses one. I believe two of the chests are also from Red Rubies. After you get 100, you can convert them to a chest here. And some of them are the special Halloween event ones, which are here. So I'm expecting some items for whatever two people call for Wendy or Jack. Now, if you guys have never played this game before, none of this is going to make any sense to you. But to the guys who have played, I'm sure, I'm sure a lot of the items will make sense. I'm hoping to get one or two rare items that you haven't seen before. And I, I had intended this to be a, a video of me opening 10 chests, but I, I got one more, so I'm not really going to complain. Right, so if we get started and go here. Okay, we're neatly arranged. Okay, so there's four different types. There's, in the six column, this will be the ones for defeating the bosses. These are the paid for ones. This is a Halloween one, and this is a special Halloween one. I have no idea what this fifth box is for. But anyway, okay, so we open it up. Our first card is a lucky coin. That's nothing special. A buff. I don't. I don't have a lineup that uses clickers, so this is actually pointless. Well, not pointless, but useless for me anyway. And an uncommon buff. Another click damage one. No, thank you. Let's go for all the uh, lower rank ones first. Gold. It's always useful. Increase this king. I don't use him that often, so he's not great for me. My main damage dealer is Jim. So that's more gold, that's good. Box number three. A duplicate for Panda. So that'll turn into a enchantment point, which I think it gives you 25% extra damage on Panda. And I do have Panda out quite a lot because of the extra gold bonus. So that's very handy. More gold. More gold. Gonna have a lot of gold after this. Now, if I was playing this game properly, I'd spend the gold now, wait 5 or 10 levels, and then open another chest. And if any of the subsequent boxes have got gold in, which I most likely will, it will be a higher amount of gold to help me progress. But I'm, I'm opening all at the same time for this video. More gold. More gold. Reduces ability cooldown by 1%. I don't tend to use the abilities that much. The only one I use is the Storm Rider, I believe it's called. With a little Thunderbolt icon. But 1% isn't really anything to shout about. Maybe if I've been playing this game for a few months of being accumulate, it might be worthwhile. But for now, I'm going to ignore them. Um, Natalie Dragon, she's useful if I've got Nate Dragon in. And I haven't got that before, so that's nice. More gold. More gold. And the last of the basic chests. That's increased DPS of all Crusaders by 5%. That's rubbish. That is a useful one. And I have used some of these sometimes to take down bosses. Nope. What I'm really after is items for Jim. These are my main damage DPS so even if it's duplicate items at least he'll get the enchantment points but okay moving on to the fancy chest so these should have five cards in them there you go and they're guaranteed to have an uncommon bit of loot in it right whoop gain four hours of time so I'm going to increase click damage by two percent it's pointless as I don't click that's useless that's okay Ooh. oh it's a duplicate all right Never mind. I know one of the achievements is for the Halloween event to get all three items on Wendy and Jack, so I'm hoping the Halloween chests have something to do with that in them. Right, another five cards. Lucky coin, increased gold by high my 2%. I suppose every penny counts. It's useless. Increased DPS for all Crusaders by 50. Ooh! This is a. Wow! Right, that might be one of the best ones so far. 15% bonus on everyone on a character I use quite a lot. That's great. And more time warps. Okay, the last of the fancy chests. 
Time warp. Increase your click damage by 4%. That would be good if I clicked. Time warp. Increase. Oh! That's what I wanted. That's okay. That is now the best card. I've got 200% when he's already my main damage dealer. And it's new. I wonder if I've got all three items on Jim now. We'll have a look quickly after this. Bronze Lucky Coin. That's good. Okay, so let's go into the Halloween ones. I don't know if it's three or five cards. Only three. It's a duplicate. I think this is what I got for doing one of the three runs. After you've completed the four challenges, you can do, um, for 3,000 of those candy tokens, you can do a free run and at the end you get a new box. Wooden horn, that's abysmal. Accuracy. Okay, so that was a useless box. But the fancy one, five cards? Ooh. Okay, come on, rare item. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Boo, enchanted. Yeah, duplicate. That would be nice if it wasn't a duplicate. I didn't actually know I had a 15% DPS increase on him. I might use him more now that I know that. Anyway. Time. Silver ring. And last card. Okay. So I think the best thing out of those 11 cards was Jim's. So if we look at what I've got for Jim now. Oh, so he's got 300 there and a 200%. I think, hmm, I think I had a 100% increase there. So this has overtaken it. Anyway, he's still my, he's still going to be my main damage dealer. I don't think any of the items I picked up on the other characters are going to be any better. However, I will start taking out Pandemon. Anyway, so that was opening up 11 boxes. I do intend to do a bigger unboxing at a future date if this game is as popular as I think it's going to be. Uh, I'm talking using the, um, if we go to a shop, doing a, more unboxings of 10 or 20 just further down the line, and especially if there's a new event like Halloween event. So if you subscribe and follow, you'll be alerted when I do those. Thanks for watching.